God asked his people how they could live in luxury when his house was lying in ruins. The temple was the focal point of Judah's relationship with God, but it was still a heap of rubble. But instead of rebuilding God's temple, the people put their energies into beautifying their own homes. However, the harder the people worked for themselves, the less they had, because they ignored their spiritual lives. Judah had confused its priorities, because the people had not given God first place in their lives. Their work was not fruitful or productive, and their material possessions did not satisfy. God's blessings was withheld, because they no longer put him first. Moses had predicated that this would be the result if the people neglected God. Deuteronomy 28, verse 38 to 45. The same happens to us. Like Judah, we put our hopes in our jobs, home relationship, and hobbies instead of in God. The problem is that none of these things can satisfy. In scarcity or abundance, we always want more. God wants us to put our hopes in Him. When we do, we will find ourselves satisfied. Matthew 6, verse 33. All other things will be peripheral blessings. It will be God who is our blessing. God bless you. This message contents something that could change your life.